In this video I will show you how to fix HDMI not working on your Xbox Series S or Series X. We will be covering multiple methods so make sure to stick around. For the first few methods we will be covering solutions that directly impact your HDMI port. Try them out first, if they don't help you out we will be covering an extra few methods towards the second part of the video, which includes solutions that are more generalized but will still impact your Xbox displaying on your display device. For the first method, make sure that the cable is fully plugged into both the console and your TV or monitor. Now try using the console and see if this was the issue. If it wasn't, move on to the next method. For the next method, try cleaning the port that you plug the HDMI in on your Xbox. There might be dust and other particles which are not allowing you to fully connect the cable. To do this, try using a soft brush or something similar, but be very careful because the ports are very fragile. Do not apply force. Then try connecting the cable and try using your console. See if this helped you, but if it didn't, move over to the next method. For the next method, make sure that you're selecting the correct source on your TV or monitor, as most devices have multiple ports that are titled HDMI 1, HDMI 2 and so on when you try to switch sources on your device. It usually says on the back of your device which is which and after you check, select the one that the HDMI from your Xbox is plugged into. Now you can try and use your Xbox. If this didn't help you, move on to the next method. For the next method, try switching the HDMI port that you are using there might be an issue with your current wall. And after you switch, try using the console and see if this fixed the issue. If it didn't, move over to the next method. For the next method, you can try resetting the Xbox display settings. To do that on your Series S console, you will need to press the Xbox power button and the pairing button at the same time. But if you're using the Series X, you will need to press the Xbox power button and the eject button at the same time. Now let's press the power button and the pairing button at the same time and you will need to hear the Xbox sound twice. And I just heard it and I released the button. This will reset your resolution. Now try turning it back on. Now after you have turned on your Xbox, after resetting the display settings, you can change the resolution because yours will be probably the lowest one available. To do that, press the Xbox button right here, then navigate to the far right and select your avatar, then scroll down and select settings. Once you get in here, go over to general on the left, then scroll to the right and select TV and display options, and here in the top left, you can change your resolution to any resolution that works for you. If this didn't help, move over to the next method. Now we will move on to the second part of this video, where we will cover methods that are more generalized, but will still impact your Xbox displaying on your display device. For the next method, try turning off your Xbox. After you do that, unplug it from the power outlet for about 10 seconds and then plug it in again. After you plug it in, turn it back on and see if this helped solve your issue. If it didn't, move over to the next method. For the last method, try connecting your Xbox to another device. This way you can check if the issue is coming from your output device. Also, try changing the HDMI cable as your current one might be having some issues. When changing the HDMI cable, make sure that you're getting one that is compatible with your console. You can check if it is by running a quick Google search. That is it for this video. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one.